to Always Analog, where we celebrate the beauty of analog technology in the digital world. And today, a pen, a ballpoint pen review. Going to look at the Link Pentonic. Uh, I've done a Link Pentonic review, oh, last month maybe. And you can check it out here on Always Analog. <clears throat> the difference was that was the medium point, the 1.0 millimeter ballpoint. And these are the fine point pentonic pens. And uh, I actually kind of kind of like the, the medium point links, uh, the pentonics anyways. And here is a two pack, which is how I I bought it. Got these on Amazon, by the way. Um, you can't. I, I don't know any stores that sell these here in the United States, but they are available through Amazon. And uh, so it comes in a box like this, 24 pieces. Uh, I will tell you, there's 12 black, I think, and 12 blue. And you can buy them that way, or you can buy all black or all blue, uh, I believe, are the other options. So you get the box, two packs, 24 pieces, Link Pentonic, right the future, it says. And distributed in market by Silage or Silage Distributors. Uh, product by Link Pen and Plastics Limited. Website made in India. Think it, link it. Kind of the same on all sides. Here's the UPC. Yeah, Link Pentonic Premium Ballpoint Pen. 0 0.7 millimeters, 12 pens blue, 12 pens black. And you've got a little paper seal there. And we open. And let's get these out. Okay. Let me come on back a little bit. So... We've got a black and a blue here. And I am going to use the blue. That's just my preference. Uh, they sh Otherwise, they're the same pen. So let's take a look at the nice looking box, by the way, I think. Very, very handsome. Uh, it has a really interesting ink uh, printing job here. So, Link, Pentonic, Write the Future. There's a picture of the pen on the box. You've got a seal at the top. Flip it over to the bottom. Ink color blue. You've got a seal at the bottom. On the side, 12 Link Pentonic. Write the future, refillable ball pen. These are refillable, so they do sell refills for these. Um, the other side is exactly the same. Then if we look on the back, now this is a pretty small writing, so I don't know if we're, we're going to do the best I can here with the camera. Link Pentonic, write the future. Welcome to the world of writing. A world of expression. Welcome to the world of Link. Our range of innovative products are designed to make your life smoother and better. Okay. Thank you. May the mighty weapon of writing spark great thoughts, words, and creativity. Ballpoint pen. And then goes on to say ballpoint pen in many different languages. Skip free writing, sleek matte finish, feather light 
feel contains 12 pens. Um, follow us. Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. Uh, Link Pen and Plastics Company, India. Now, it's funny, nowhere on here does it indicate that these are medium, or I'm sorry, these are fine, a 0 0.7 millimeter uh, ballpoint. I guess it's only on the outer box. So my guess, they use this box for all the pens. Okay, so you can kind of see here the way that they package. It's really cool. They print on the inside of the box, uh, which is neat. Uh, kind of, you're not expecting that. It's sort of a surprise when you open it. And you're looking at six bottoms and six tops. So we're going to get one out here to inspect a little closer. Here we go. So this is the, again, the pen, unlike a Bic or a Papermate, they don't print the ballpoint size anywhere here that you can see. So let's start with the end of the back end of the pen. You have this little flap here. It doesn't do anything. It's strictly decorative and it just indicates the ink color. So on the black, let me, let me get a black one out. We can put side by side here. Okay. So there you go. So, you know, although it's because the body is black, I guess they got to make a piece of gray or silver plastic here to indicate black. Otherwise, uh, I guess it would just all be one, one color since the barrel of the pen is black. But uh, then you flip open and flip over and then at the top of the cap, you see uh, that it is also color keyed to the ink. And if the camera will pick it up, it says link embossed there. And then here's the tip. of the pen it has a little piece of rubber on the tip there, which I will take off. Um, and you can there, they said it was refillable. So there you go. You would buy this piece uh, and it says link. 02-19 India. Now, I don't know if the 219 indicates when this was made, February of 2019. I don't know if that's what that is, or that's some sort of stock number. I don't know. We'll put it back. Okay. Then you can post the cap very easily and nicely on the end of the pen. And then you have your blue, kind of a, a needle point there. And you have a blue band collar at the, the tip. It is very light. When they say featherweight, they're not kidding. All right, let's write with this thing and see how it does. Okay. We have our rights right away. It is a very smooth pen. And I think I've shared this. I love the Bic Crystal 
the bold, the 1.6 millimeter. So I'm used to, I'm, 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 and I use it a lot. I'm used to using a ballpoint pen with a, a ball, almost a, an entire millimeter larger than this. So this really to me is a very fine point. And I know they even make smaller, uh, you know, 0 0.5 millimeter points, but this is, um, this is a different writing experience for me, but I, I like how it feels. The pen is so light though. It's so light. I don't know if I want to say it's too light, but it's so light that sometimes I don't, I feel like the pen is almost not with me because it's almost, you, you almost don't, I mean, you feel it, but it's just so airy. I have to be conscious that I have to have it on the page. I do believe this is also available in red ink as well. Okay, we have a little smudge there. Let's do that again for our left-handed friends. Uh, you have a little bit if you are if you are pulling your hand over the freshly inked impression, uh, you might get a little smudging there. Now I'm going to try it again, and let's just. Let's just give it 10 or 15 seconds and see what happens. Uh, because certainly everything that I've written up here is dry and not smudging. So yeah, so it dries, uh, uh, but, but there's a delay. It's not an instantaneous drying on the page. It's a nice writing pen. These are not expensive pens, by the way. Um, they're probably very inexpensive in India. Uh, cost in the U.S. is maybe about 40 cents a pen, 45 cents a pen. Um, yeah, and you know, it's funny, we're not accustomed to refilling pens here in the U.S. We just 
everything's disposable. Um, I can see where, you know, uh, refill has value. Uh, so it's nice to know that these can be easily refilled. The ink flows freely and smoothly and uh, it is a ballpoint. There is a gelness about the ink a little bit. But the fine line, that fine, that 0 0.7 millimeter tip does allow one to keep loops more open. Very nice. So I like this pen. Uh, the Pentonic. Made in India. By Link. Available in blue, black. Again, I think this is also available in red ink. Very lightweight pen. Uh, smooth writing. And... Um, you know, economical, certainly, and a nice alternative to some of the kind of inexpensive ballpoint pens we're used to writing with. So, I like it. I will use this pen, um, I think, probably with some frequency. So, thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching and if you like what i do here please share subscribe like i look forward to seeing you again soon right here on always analog